It is time to take control of your health or help someone you love take control of theirs. That's what takes that's what take a loved one to the doctor day is all about. Marissa Mortaboy from the Durham County Health Department and Chastity Newkirk from the Durham Diabetes Coalition are here to help us do it and tell us about take a loved one to a doctor day. Thank you so much for being here. Mm -hmm. Thank you. So what is take a loved one to the doctor day on November 1st? Well, take a loved one to the doctor is an initi initiative started in 2002 by the Department of Health and Human Services and the Tom Joyner uh, morning show and so it's to promote knowing your health status and prevent getting preventive health care and so bring a loved one to the doctor and our event on November 1st at the Durham County Department of Public Health is going to feature uh, it's going to be a whole family event we're going to have kids activities we're also going to have free health screenings and we're going to have um, a fresh produce giveaway as well and nice. we're giving away bikes um, as well to kids who wouldn't normally be able to afford one. Wow. And so we're going to have all kinds of events and people can find out more about their health status and, and take action if they find out that they uh, need to see a provider to, to get more. Yeah, you'll have some flu shots at that event for some people? We will. Uh, the vaccine, children that are eligible for the Vaccines for Children program, so it's kids 18 and under, we're going to have a limited amount of flu shots so mm -hmm. parents can bring their kids to get those flu shots. And how many people are actually living with diabetes in Durham County? Well, in Durham County, about 12% of Durham County adults, whether they're diagnosed or not, are living with type 2 diabetes. So we want to bring out people who are at risk for type 2 diabetes and may not know it so they can get screened and find out more. And there are a number of events going on throughout November. Yes. Right. Tell yeah, us about it. So the Take a Little One event is our kickoff for American Diabetes Month. Um, and then we're also going to have a grocery store tour, um, helping people better shop on a budget and shop healthier. We're also going to have a diabetes workshop series that kind of goes over in more detail uh, what type 2 diabetes is and ways to better manage that. And then the last event that we're going to have is a diabetes medication workshop. Since people really don't understand medication like they should, we're going to have an endocrinologist wow. answering questions and providing assistance with medication management. Great. Well, congratulations, of course, on winning the Robert Wood Johnson Foundation Prize. What does that mean for the county just in general? Uh, well, we're very excited about that prize as well because it was a huge accomplishment and a huge mm -hmm. honor. We're one of six uh, award winners out of the whole entire country, 250 applicants. And so that means that we're recognized for our innovative practices to make the community healthier. So doing things like helping people get more access to health care, um, helping people have more access to fresh fruits and vegetables like we're going to have at our event on November the 1st, mm -hmm. and to be more active. And you got a cash prize. We do. How we got $25,000. I wow. believe that is still in discussion. Um, and so we, ha we have some ideas. It's definitely all the money's going to go to uh, helping the community. Wow. To, yeah, we look to forward to you coming back to tell us how you're going to use it. <laughs> 25000 <laughs> That's awesome. 